DNS is critical networking infrastructure. Every email, instant message, website, and business application relies on DNS. It's a prime target for hackers, and roughly 80% of organizations have experienced attacks on DNS. A lot of companies don't understand the importance of DNS and don't know how vulnerable they are to attacks. Plus, DNS traffic isn't inspected by common security controls like firewalls, intrusion detection systems, and proxies. In this security overview, I'll describe the main threats to DNS, some basic mitigation strategies, and how Infoblox products fit into the security landscape. Domain name system servers link names to IP addresses. So when you visit google.com, you're actually visiting an IP address assigned to a server. This process is called DNS resolution. A domain name is resolved to an address. This is useful because people generally can remember words better than a series of numbers. It's also useful for allowing services to move to different IP addresses without having to change the domain names that are being used. DNS isn't limited to just web browsing. Email servers get resolved to IP addresses, and business applications use DNS to get data from other servers. Without DNS, your email application wouldn't know where to find your email, your web browser wouldn't know how to find google.com, and your business applications wouldn't be able to exchange data. Without DNS, your users would basically be shut out of the Internet. What would the cost be to your business if DNS stopped working? Lost revenue? Maybe over $100,000 per hour? Lost customers? Consumed and overtaxed IT departments? And if the outage lasts long enough, permanent brand damage. Some recent data breaches have cost more than $100 million. Enterprises need to start thinking of DNS as a core network infrastructure, the same way they regard routing and switching. Some of the main threats to DNS servers include distributed denial of service attacks, malware, advanced persistent threats, and data exfiltration. In a distributed denial of service attack, multiple, sometimes thousands of systems flood the DNS server with bogus requests to resolve domain names to IP addresses that may or may not exist. The server is unable to handle all of the requests, and legitimate requests are unable to get through, so your network performance is either slow or it doesn't work at all. Many DDoS attacks are carried out by botnets, which is a collection of computers that have been compromised by some sort of malware and can be controlled by an operator. By using many different systems to attack a DNS server, a hacker can generate more traffic and multiple machines are more difficult to locate and shut down. In order for the bots and the botnet to be controlled, they first need to communicate with their operator and they use DNS ports and protocols to do it. Some companies will combat DDoS attacks by adding more bandwidth. Another mitigation strategy is to use load balancers to spread the traffic across a number of DNS servers in the hope that the attack will stop at some point. Infrastructure over-provisioning is a short-sighted strategy because it won't be able to keep up with the rapidly increasing size of DDoS attacks, and it doesn't help monitor bad or malformed DNS traffic that can crash DNS servers. Simple response rate limiting helps mitigate DDoS attacks by reducing the rate at which the DNS server responds to queries. It's a one-size-fits-all approach to setting a threshold with no intelligence that can lead to legitimate traffic being dropped. Next-generation firewalls and intrusion detection systems offer some protection against common vulnerabilities. However, they don't have the ability to detect or mitigate DNS-specific protocol anomalies or DNS-based attacks. They require extremely high compute performance to accurately detect DNS-based attacks, making deep inspection an impractical approach in terms of cost and the number of distribution points that are needed. To protect against DDoS attacks, your DNS architecture should detect and drop the attack queries before they reach the core DNS server.
The DNS server should not use valuable resources to process these requests. It should stay up to date with new and evolving threats automatically. There should be no need for writing scripts or manually applying new protection rules to the DNS server every time a new threat is detected. DNS patterns and attacks might not be the same for each organization. Customization of protection is necessary to minimize false positives. You should be able to adjust parameters for each rule to customize them for your environment. A centralized reporting capability is important to provide visibility into the load on the system, diagnose problems, and to enable multiple teams to identify attacks that are happening across the system. InfoBlox Advanced DNS Protection is a DNS server appliance built with security in mind. It defends against the widest range of DNS-based cyber attacks such as DDoS, NX domain, exploits, and DNS hijacking attacks. Unlike approaches that rely on infrastructure over-provisioning or simple response rate limiting, advanced DNS protection intelligently detects and mitigates DNS attacks while responding only to legitimate queries. InfoBlox Advanced DNS Protection leverages dedicated compute to filter out attacks before they reach the DNS server or application. It continuously monitors, detects, and drops various types of DNS attacks while responding to legitimate queries. It also automatically updates defenses against new and evolving threats as they emerge without the need for patching by using Threat Adapt technology. And it's fast and easy to get up and running. Once installed, it starts blocking attacks immediately, even if an attack is already in progress. InfoBlox reporting and analytics provides long-term network reporting, trending, and tracking. Instead of manually cobbling together reports one by one, InfoBlox reporting and analytics provides pre-built reports for easier administration and robust monitoring. Reporting in a separate appliance means zero overhead on your core network DDI services. When addressing security concerns, a single point of management can be essential to maintaining network integrity. With today's increasingly complex and critical networks, the need for historical tracking, documentation, and forensics grows rapidly. InfoBlox reporting and analytics helps identify security threats by tracking where threats are coming from through detailed trending. Data breaches are growing at a staggering pace, and over 100,000 new malware samples are being cataloged every day. In their 2016 annual security report, Cisco found that 91% of malware uses DNS to carry out campaigns. Malware is any software that has malicious intent. It's usually installed and operates without the knowledge of the user. Trends like bring your own device and cloud computing complicate the situation by providing new avenues for malware to enter the network. Once the malware has infiltrated the network, it spreads to other devices, and then attempts to contact its command and control server via DNS ports and protocols to receive further instructions. Advanced persistent threats refer to the sophisticated use of malware and other techniques to infiltrate a specific target. APTs are often associated with groups or governments that have significant resources available to coordinate a complex attack with espionage or sabotage objectives. Once an APT has infiltrated the network, it will target specific systems and attempt to exfiltrate sensitive data little by little to avoid detection. Next-gen firewalls are in every organization, and some have mitigation for DNS-based malware. However, because firewalls are not DNS servers, they lack critical device and network context that is readily available to a DNS server data that can help shorten the time to remediation. InfoBlox DNS Firewall is the leading DNS-based network security solution. It contains and controls malware by disrupting the ability of infected devices to communicate with command and control sites and botnets. It provides up-to-date protection with InfoBlox Threat Intelligence Feed, 
which automatically updates RPZ policies with malicious internet destinations such as host names and domains. It leverages InfoBlock's DHCP fingerprinting to identify infected devices for remediation. It integrates with InfoBlock's reporting and analytics to provide insight on top RPZ hits, top malicious internet destinations and devices, and users that attempted to communicate with malicious locations. Theft of sensitive or regulated data and intellectual property is one of the most serious risks to an enterprise. DNS is a leading vector for data exfiltration because it is not inspected by common security products such as firewalls, IDS, and proxies. According to a leading IT security magazine, a recent survey of 300 enterprise IT decision makers showed that close to 46% experienced data exfiltration via DNS and another 45% experienced DNS tunneling. When sensitive information is stolen, it causes financial and legal woes, not to mention the huge negative impact to brand. Data can be exfiltrated via DNS tunneling or embedded within DNS queries themselves. An endpoint infected with malware or a malicious insider can steal a file containing sensitive data. Sophisticated techniques involve the data being encrypted and broken into chunks. The chunks are then exfiltrated as DNS queries. The exfiltrated data chunks are then reassembled by the attackers out on the Internet. Standard tunneling toolkits like Iodine, which is often considered the gold standard, Ozyman DNS, Split Brain, DNS to TCP, and TCP over DNS can also be used to tunnel data via DNS. InfoBlock's Advanced DNS Protection has two mitigation techniques for preventing data exfiltration via DNS. Most DNS tunneling toolkits, like Iodine, have well-known signatures, which can be used to create protection rules. Advanced DNS Protection has 12 different threat protection rules that use these signatures to detect tunneling attempts. As new signatures become available, customers get automatic updates through the Threat Intelligence Service. In addition, InfoBlox uniquely offers InfoBlox Threat Insight, which can automatically detect and block sophisticated data exfiltration attempts that encrypt and embed data directly in DNS queries. It uses real-time streaming analytics of live DNS queries and machine learning to accurately detect the presence of data in DNS queries. InfoBlox Threat Insight not only detects data exfiltration, but it can enable active blocking of those attempts by automatically adding destinations associated with data exfiltration to the InfoBlox DNS firewall blacklist. DNS Firewall subsequently blocks communications to those domains and Threat Insight will send grid-wide updates to all InfoBlox members with DNS firewalling and RPZ capability. This ensures scaling of protection to all parts of the network. I hope this security overview has raised your awareness of DNS vulnerabilities and convinced you that the health and well-being of your network could very well depend on how soon you add DNS-specific protection. Security built in is better than security bolted on. There is no better place to defend against DNS exploiting techniques than within the DNS servers that are its targets. For more information about InfoBlox and DNS security products, please visit infoblox.com.